Peter, massive congratulations on being named the 2024 Petro Sivina Siva medalist. Has it sunk in yet? Yeah, it doesn't sink in yet, but uh, first of all, I want to say th thank to the men upstairs for the year 2024. And with our interior, I just came finish all the season. And I just want to say a big thank you to the men upstairs. And that uh, medal, I just wanted, it doesn't sink into, into me yet. So I'm still, I'm still out of words here. <laughs> You had a very strong year helping the PNG Hunters to the final for the first time in seven years. What helped you go to the next level this season? Oh, it's just, um, I had uh, just prison with the Dolphins and I feel like I built uh, myself up there and then I came back to PNG Hunters team and yeah, the coaches, coaching staff been good and sponsors and the CEO and everyone been good to the team all year and um, yeah, that helped me that uh, I was being part of the team. So that's what really helped me uh, to do week in, week out, good footy. And so has my family been good to me, so support and all that. So it helps me a lot in my footy career and upwards. And yeah, it's, it's so grateful to receive the award as well. What was the biggest thing you learnt from that Dolphins NRL preseason? Oh, it is about uh, professionalism on and off the field. That's, that's the biggest thing I learned. And I just normally do like, like my weekly routine. So. That's, that's the biggest thing I learned to be professional on and off the field. For yourself, where does this, this year rate in your career? Oh, this year rated as one of my best career so far, yeah. So I gained a lot of confidence playing test matches and coming up, so I get a lot of, lot of confidence and I rate this year as one of my best year. Obviously, the season ended for the Hunters in the preliminary finals. I'm sure the disappointment is still there, but, but how proud are you of, of how far the team has come this year? Oh, yeah. Uh, we lost to North Devils last weekend. We, didn't, we, didn't, we, we were wanted to go to the grand final and we lost against North. And we were really disappointed, but um, it's good. After seven years, we make the finals and we lost in preliminary final. And our coach believed in us that we're going to make top four. And, it's really good to finish off top four, but um, for myself and the, the boys, they still have a lot of resilience. Most of the boys, some of the boys on and off uh, the uh, game, but most, some of our boys were injured and all that, but some of the young boys stood out. It wasn't for them, I wouldn't get this award, but I'm so grateful for the boys and the team and the coaching staff and everyone that participated in PNG Anders. Who has been the biggest support for you? Oh, biggest support, my family, my family and probably loved ones, yeah, they've been supporting me throughout the year and it just makes me easy to go back to and from trainings and play good footy. My family's been good to me and especially my mom, big bro, and those who support me behind the scenes and yeah, and uh, coaching staff and management also been part of the season as well, so I'm so grateful for that. What's next for you? Oh, fingers crossed, fingers crossed, man. Um, so I'm just looking forward for what's ahead for me. Finally, what does this medal mean to you? What does it represent for you? Oh, this medal, it means, it means uh, a lot. Player of the year, I didn't expect to get it, but it means a lot. I just want to say thanks to God that he helped me get through this. And most past players have done it, and that's yes, and I just created my own legacy. So I'm so grateful, I'm so blessed, and I'm so stoked that I received this medal. And um, I think this, this will, I don't know, stay with me forever, and yeah. I'm so grateful to receive the uh, medal as well. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it.